Hi guys, it's Mink Dean here, home of the cringiest videos on the internet. That's gonna be my new motto. <laughs> motto? I mean, yeah. Um, today I'm gonna be starting a series. It's called the Mario Kart series. A simple name for a simple series. This Mario Kart series is where I, um, talk about my favorite my two favorite Mario Kart games, Mario Kart Wii and 7. Um, today, my second video of the series is the worst to best Mario Kart tracks in the game, in Mario Kart 7. Now, starting us off at 32 is SNES Rainbow Road. It has the sharpest turns, it, it just sucks, you know? There's not that much to say. The, sw the thwomp suck, I hate them. And yeah, I hate it, I hate it so much. 31 is Rosalina Ice World. Oh my god, it sucks. I hate the turn with like the huge gap. It's kind of like DK Summit from Mario Kart Wii. But like it's worse, way worse. I hate the ice, like icicles sticking out of the ground. Oh my god, they slow you down so much. Thirty is shy guy bizarre. Now, this track, yeah, it might be easy, but I hate it still. It's just, do you know, at in the, like the middle of the track. There's like the sides of the road that slow you down. I was in a race at a Grand Prix and then it slowed me down. I didn't know what was slowing me down. It just like camouflages with the road. Anyway, that's it. 29, oh my god, I hate Luigi's Mansion. Really, it's self explanatory. There's a huge mud yard that slows you down. It just sucks, you know? And it has sharp turns, like Smash Rainbow Road. 28 is Mario Circuit 2 from Smash. It's just a plain track, you know? Not that much to it, except that glider ramp, but that's really it. Um, 27 is Airship Fortress. I don't think... You can consider this a good track to anybody. If you ask anybody you've ever known that's played Mario Kart 7 before, or Mario Kart DS, because it was on there, they would probably hate it, because Airship Fortress is the worst. I hate it. It's not the worst one on my list, but, yeah. Luigi Raceway is 26th, and it's just, like... Mario Kart's, I mean, Mario, Mario Circuit 2, it's just a plain track, just, just like a, it just, there's a couple turns, yeah, there's a tunnel, sure, but still, it's kind of plain. Um, 25th is Bowser Castle 1 from GBA. Most of the bottom on the list are, bottom race tracks on the list are just retro tracks, mostly. But, anyway, 25 is Bowser Castle 1, and, like I said, plain track. Just nothing to it, you know? Except the ramps in the middle, but that's really it. 24 is another plain track. Jeep Jeep Lagoon. It's one of the first um, tracks you play. And... Um, speaking of plane tracks, um, most of these until like around 19 or 16 are just plane tracks. So, 23 is Toad Circuit. Plane. Okay, Daisy Hills is 22 and plane. Um, 21 is not actually plane, not that plane, but... Pretty in the middle, yeah. Um, it's Rock Rock Mountain. I mean, 
It's just a good track. Yeah, I love it, but I don't just see what's, for, what's like to it, you know? 20 is Wario Shipyard. I hate it. Well, I don't hate it that much, but it's fun to play, but it's not fun to play. Um, Wario Shipyard is kind of hard, if you will. Um, um, yeah. I mean, is Wario even in the game? I don't know. I'll have to see that. 19 is Piran Piranha Plant Slide. Like the name implies, you might think there's a lot of piranha plants, but there's only like three. There's more thwomps than piranha plants than piranha plant slide. 18 is Nero Bowser City. It's fine. Yeah. 17 is Calamari Desert. I don't really see what what's to it. I mean, it's just a desert. And the thing that's bad about it is you can't go in the tunnel anymore. So, yeah, I put it at 17. Threw it at 17. If it was like if it, you if you could go to the tunnel, tunnel, I would put it at like maybe like 11 or so or 10. 16 is Koopa Beach. Um I don't really see what's to that either, except the tunnel shortcut. It's pretty cool. Um, 15, DK Pass, I like it. And at Koopa Beach, we're at our halfway spot, and this means, like, it's getting to okay. So, DK Pass is good. It's kind of plain, but it's kind of good. 14... I love this on the Wii, Maple Tree Way. They kind of ruined it, though. They they ruined the huge net bouncing everywhere. Oh, my God. I love that thing. And you it you have to glide through the air. It, I mean, it do, it, it's not really a difference, but it's just... Uh, whatever. 19 is Dino, Dino Jungle. And, uh, GameCube track, GameCube track, um, it's actually pretty fun, it's actually pretty fun to play, and that's why I'm putting it at number 13. Number 12 is Coconut Mall, who doesn't love Coconut Mall, you know, I met nobody that hates Coconut Mall, my sister loves Coconut Mall. Um, 11 is Daisy Cruiser. It has a nice, like, atmosphere, since it's, like, a cruise ship, and there's, like, a whole racetrack on it. That would be a cool, that would be really cool if it was in real life. Um, um, 10 is Mushroom Gorge. Um, they kind of ruined it, too, like Maple Treeway, but not that much. I mean, you can't do the gap jump anymore. That sucks. And flipping over my notes that I wrote all this on, at number nine is Mario Circuit. Yeah, um, surprisingly, it's at number nine, and um, Mario Circuit is just not a plain track, actually. It's not more like it kind of reminds me of Toad Circuit, but it it has more detail to it. There's more like turns and everything, you know. Eight is DK Jungle, a nice um, track in the start. I mean, the Special Cup, and you just can't do go wrong with it, you know. Seven is Woohoo Loop uh, from Wii Sports Resort. I love that game, so that's why I put it at number seven. And it's um, Big Brother Maka Woohoo is next at number five. Um. I don't really see the difference between these two tracks, except Maka Woohoo is not a loop, like a circle, and um, Woohoo Loop is a circle. I, just, I mean, yeah, it's, no, it's not really a difference. Four is Bowser, I mean, five, actually. Five is Koopa Cape. Um, so, 
Wii, mostly the, the Wii tracks are the best. I love Wii tracks. They're home of the greatest tracks in the Mario Kart franchise. And that is why all these are under the halfway point at 16. Because I absolutely love all of the Wii tracks. Four is Bowser Castle. Castle. Um, it's just an, your normal Bowser Castle. In my opinion, Wii's Bowser Castle is the best. But, you know. Music Park is number three. Music Park is really good. I love it. People don't really enjoy playing it that much, but I love it. I love the piano thing and the notes bouncing around. It just adds to the track. If there weren't, if there weren't like a piano or notes bouncing around, it would probably be at like number sixteen, probably. Two, I think you were probably expecting this is Rainbow Road. It's close to number one, but it's not. It is not number one. Rainbow Road is one of the best tracks in this game, and that's why I put it at number two. So, Rainbow Road, it. It adds like so much, you know. There's, there's all the planets, unlike other, um, Mario Kart. I mean, Rainbow Road tracks. Um, it's not as much. It's not that challenging as Mario Kart Wii's is, because I love Mario Kart Wii's Rainbow Road too. Um, I would probably rate Wii's Rainbow Road over um, on um, the Mario Kart Sevens, but. Yeah, one, number one, I'm going to have some honorable mentions of tracks that weren't able to make it to the game, so, um, yeah, let's get into the honorable mentions, um, first up is, um, Rainbow Road from Wii, and Rainbow Road from Double Dash, I love those tracks. Actually, I've never played the Double Dash one, but it seems like a good track. Don't get me wrong there. Um, the number two spot, or three, for honorable mentions is probably, like, hmm. Bowser Castle from Wii. Oh, my God. And, yeah, yeah. Um... Yeah, that's all the honorable mentions that I can think of. I didn't add it to my list. I just thought of it mid-video. Number one spot. Get ready for this. I love it so much. I don't know how it's one of the best tracks. I think... I, I don't know how it's one of the best tracks that I can think of. That, can, that I've ever played before. It's Waluigi Pinball, and I love it. I absolutely love the detail. I love the obstacles. It gives it more challenge. It it gives it more challenge for you to complete it, and I love it so much. Oh my god! So that's all the best tracks in Mario Kart Seven. Mario Kart Wii is coming up next obviously and yeah so hopefully you guys enjoyed make sure to subscribe and i love the support you guys are giving me so far this year so i love to make more quality videos if you know uh, if you know what i mean but for now goodbye